Morning. Good morning. It's Jay Nye, the tire crane guy. Some of you know me as Jason. This morning we're going to talk about another life lesson. It's about fear. The fear within and the fear without. So, everybody has them. It doesn't matter who you are. Big, small, short, tall. Uh, the meanest person in the world who thinks he's the biggest badass. It doesn't matter who you are. Everybody has a fear and insecurity. So, when the, the hardest thing for human beings is to face fear. Because it's a, it's a change that people are in fear of. Uh, us as humans are real comfortable with uh, doing things routinely. I'm, I'm guilty of it. I love a, a routine. And, and if I have to change that routine, I probably get uncomfortable and somewhat shitty. <laughs> so facing a fear or going, getting out of your comfort zone is probably the best thing I ever did for myself. Um... I've been in construction for a very long time and and had a routine of doing the same thing every single day, week, month, and year and uh, got out of that routine and, and took a chance. And, and taking chances, sometimes they pay off and sometimes they don't. Um, that's why they call it a chance. So there's no such thing as luck. There really isn't. You, you are the captain of your own ship, and you predict where your life is going to go based on your choices. If you repeatedly make bad choices, well, bad shit's going to happen. And it's just, and it's inevitable. If you make good choices, good things will happen, and they may not happen right away. You may have to make a lot of good choices just to get one result. So, <clears throat> I've learned in life that things happen like in a snowball effect like a bunch of good things will happen and maybe something bad will happen and it doesn't mean necessarily like devastating bad it just can be like a bump in the road so the the the, the main subject this morning is fear if you're not willing to accept fear for what it is and face it head on you'll always be in the same place you know for years i thought I wasn't good enough for this or good enough for that. And I started facing that fear of asking. The worst answer you can get in the world is no. Someone just tell you no. So, you know, when, when I go into a new job, I, I ask for top dollar every single time. Why? What's the worst they can tell me? No. They can tell me no. Or they can meet me halfway, you know. Uh, don't ever let fear control you to the point where you don't ask for more money at a job, you know, from a boss. Ask for a raise. You know, when you're going to a new job, ask him for that top dollar. If you don't ask, you'll, you'll never know the answer. You know, and the worst thing they can tell you is no. That's, that's the worst thing they can tell you, and so what? Uh, I shared a post just right before this video and said I have made many mistakes in order... It basically says I've made many mistakes to get to this point. And I have. I've made tons of mistakes. Tons of them. But I learned from them. I've learned from each and every mistake. And sometimes I had to repeat the mistake several times just to learn one lesson. So, don't ever let fear consume you to the point where you don't speak your mind. Because the worst thing that somebody can do is get mad at you for speaking your mind. If they're really a true friend or a family member, they'll get over it. And if you have to, you might have to apologize. You know, uh, I have no filter at all. I'll tell you exactly how I feel. And if you don't like it, I don't know what to tell you. Uh, you can get all up in your feelings and, and be butthurt about it. And, and uh, you know, I'll be the first one to, to give you one of these. You know, I just, I don't care. And it took many years to get to that point where I don't care. Because I used to care. I used to... I used to censor what I said to people and 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 not sh and not give them my true feelings and and I quit doing that. I quit doing that because I had it done to me several times. 
And I learned, you know what? That's probably the best way to be. Just tell people exactly how you feel. And if they don't like it, you know, then they don't like it. And that's the way it is. And if they, they don't like it and they don't talk to you no more, then they weren't a true friend, you know? So never be consumed by the fear of you can't do better for yourself or you can't have a better job or you can't be in a better position in life. Because you can always be in a better position if you just take that chance and lose the fear. That's all you got to do. Uh, I had a fear of heights for years, you know, and I finally put that aside and now I do what I do. You know, I never let, you know, I never let fear consume me to the point where I couldn't better myself. Bettering yourself is facing your own fear and taking on the challenge of, I can do better. You can always do better in life. There's no one stopping you but you. I, I learned that the hard way. You know, no one stopped me but me. Letting bosses put you down and tell you, you you can't make more money or you can't do better. That's just absolute bullshit. That's just someone trying to hold you down and keep you at a lower pay. If you know that you do top quality work at whatever you do, and we've talked about this before, whether you're pushing a broom or you're the top person on the job, if you know that you are doing a great job for that company or that business, and you know that you're given top performance, then ask for more money. You deserve to be paid more money. You deserve to do better. And, and no one can hold you back but you. So that's all I wanted to talk about a little bit this morning. We're putting in some OT, and uh, like I do every Saturday morning. I love it. And uh, we're just getting ready to, to conquer the day. Just keep this in mind. Whenever you're feeling less than or someone's making you feel less than, Evaluate the situation. Is someone trying to hold you down or is someone trying to make you do better? That's, that's the question. You know, a true friend will tell you exactly how they feel no matter what. No matter if it pisses you off or not. You know, it's up to you to decide who's holding you back in life and who's not. I can, I can personally tell you this. I have many acquaintances and I only have a few friends. I really do. And I like it that way. This way I know if I'm fucking up, excuse all my language, but if I'm messing up, I know they'll put me in check. And I know that I can argue with them, and five minutes later we'll be fine. So just remember, the only thing you have to fear in life is the fear of yourself. And if you don't fear anything inside, you'll never fear anything outside. That's all I got today. I hope that that maybe helps somebody. I just want to get it off my chest and, and tell someone today that might be struggling with a new job or, or wanting to take that leap into something new. Don't let nothing hold you back. The only thing holding you back is you. You can always better yourself if you just got to get inside your mind and get rid of the fear. So I'm Jay Nye, the Tower Crane Guy, signing off for now. Remember, if it don't make dollars, sure the hell it doesn't make any sense. Why are you doing it? Ask yourself that. Why are you doing it? You're always worth more. You just got to find the resources to do it. You're only as good as your last pick, and I promise you guys, we'll see you on the next pick. Peace!